Today we're talking about all the ways the color red can improve your health. And seeing red when you brush your teeth is a warning sign you should never ignore because it can be a clue to your overall health. And here to help us explain why is dental hygienist Amy Hazelwood. Welcome to the show, Amy. Thank you very much. Glad to be back. A lot of people don't realize this, but maintaining good oral health, it helps keep your teeth not only free from cavities, but it can help prevent gum disease. One in two American adults has gingivitis. They don't even know it. And the most common cause of poor oral hygiene is just not taking good enough care of your teeth, maybe using the wrong products, not brushing off enough, not flossing. And this can lead to problems. Yeah, right. Uh, well, first of all, gingivitis is an early form of gum disease. It's caused by the plaque bacteria that starts to cause a swelling of the gums, and it can affect the other tissues and the bone that helps surround and support the teeth. And people often don't know they have it because they ignore the symptoms of bleeding, um, a little redness, and maybe a little bit of soreness when they go to brush and floss. And a lot of people think, well, you know, what's the big deal? A little bit mm -hmm. of gingivitis, a little inflammation of my gums, what's to worry? But We've talked on this show a number of times about the importance of good oral health because there are some studies out there that suggest poor oral health can lead to poor overall health. There are some studies suggesting a link between poor oral health with heart disease, diabetes, even preterm birth. So this is important. And also, you need to prevent gingivitis before it causes long-term harm. Right. Um, even if you have any of the symptoms or if you don't, there are plenty of things that you can do to prevent and treat gingivitis. <laughs> First of all, you should brush and use a rinse at least twice a day. Um, you should use products that are shown to reduce plaque and gingivitis. Yeah. And you should keep yourself well hydrated and be sure and visit your dentist at least twice a year for a thorough dental cleaning. And then I recommend products to my patients to use in between their dental visits so they can help protect their mouths. And Crest has developed a new product. It's called uh, Crest Pro Health Invigorating Clean. And a recent study showed 100% of those who use the Crest Pro Health Invigorating Clean, along with their toothbrush and floss, showed that they had reduced plaque and gingivitis in just two weeks. The two together with all those other um, products in the regimen really made people get better dental checkups by having less plaque and gingivitis. And we talked about red as the warning sign. That's if mm -hmm. whenever you're brushing your teeth, or you're flossing your teeth, if you're having excessive bleeding, that's a sign of poor gum health. Is that right? It is, yeah. But sometimes you don't have other symptoms of pain, and so it can progress into a very much more serious form of gum disease called periodontitis. And that's where the bone starts to disintegrate around the teeth. And sometimes people don't even know it until their teeth get loose. And so that's why it's so important to have proper dental treatment and just change your oral care habits to improve. And you can really stop the progress of periodontal disease at that point. It's one of the number one reasons for tooth loss in this country. So the moral of the story is if you're worried about your overall health, don't forget about your oral health. Amy, thanks so much for being with us today. We really appreciate it.